The shape of rubella is known as icosahedral nucleocapsid. The inside of the virus is filled with RNA and the lipid bilayer membrane holds glycoprotein. The rubella virus comes from the genus of rubivirus. Children are the preferred host of rubella as well as pregnant women. However, anyone can be infected. If a woman is infected while pregnant, it could cause birth defects and miscarriages. The incubation period can range anywhere from 2 to 3 weeks or 14 to 21 days. 21. With days 4 and 5 of the illness, the body temperature can reach up to 104 degrees Fahrenheit and the rash and cough are at their peak. Symptoms of rubella include mild fever of 102 degrees Fahrenheit or lower, headache, stuffy nose or runny nose, inflamed or red eyes, and enlarged tender lymph nodes. Aching joints also are a symptom most commonly found in young women. The most well-known trait of rubella is the pink rash that starts on the face and quickly spreads down to the arms and legs. It then disappears in the same sequence. Because of the mostly common fever symptoms, many people do not get the illness diagnosed and therefore do not get treatment. Charles Hoffman was the first person to make a clinical description of rubella in 1740. William George Mouton was the first person to differentiate scarlet fever from rubella. Rubella infects a new host by becoming airborne through coughing or sneezing. Hosts can be tainted by coming in contact with any nasal or throat secretions of the infected. Rubella can also live on surfaces for several hours. The virus burrows inside the host through endocytosis. It then infects the cells and replicates. To prevent obtaining measles, you can get a vaccination within 72 hours of contact. You can also take a dose of immune globulin within 6 days after contact with the virus. Sorry Mary Poppins, but it's not all that delightful. Sadly, immune globulin must be injected with a syringe, which isn't the most pleasant thing, but hey, sure beats having the possibility of dying. From January 1st to October 31st, 2014, there have been 603 cases of rubella in the U.S. and 20 outbreaks. 2014 has the highest rate of measles cases from 2001 to present day, which is silly because there is a safe vaccination available. In the lysogenic cycle, the virus injects itself into the host cell and the cell reproduces with the provirus inside, creating other cells with the virus. In the lytic cycle, the virus injects itself into the host cell and then breaks down the DNA. After the DNA has been broken down, the virus directs the DNA where to go to create new viruses. Then, the cell breaks and releases 100 to 200 more virus particles. Ready then.